I. I'm not gonna go like crazy into this, but I'm going through a breakup and I have, before the breakup, I was debating on cutting my hair and <laughs> I'm gonna fit that stereotype, you know, girls cutting their hair when crazy stuff happens. But I have had short hair before. I've cut my own hair in situations where life hasn't been crazy. I just felt like it. So I don't do it just as an emotional response. I'm doing it because I don't know, it's just, it's a good length right now, I like it, but I miss short hair. I haven't had short hair in maybe a year and a half, so I'm just gonna do it. Um, I have some shears from like Sally's Beauty Supply. Obviously this isn't going to be perfect, it isn't, I'm not a hairstylist, so this is not gonna be super amazing, but like, it's very therapeutic and um, I'm gonna have to be patient, not cut anything crazy, so. Yeah, I'm um, probably gonna just do a time lapse and um, hope you enjoy. <laughs> a little bit more than I expected but honestly like it grows back and it was unhealthy anyways so I just thought what, what the hell like um so it's not very even at all which is obviously completely expected because I don't have a degree in doing hair professionally if you guys are hairstylists and you're cringing I'm very sorry um but it's okay it's my hair it'll be fine I'll get it done. My hair size is probably gonna be like, what the hell did you do? I'm gonna be like, listen, listen. <laughs> but anyways, um, there we go. My hair is healthier now and short hair is cute. So I don't regret it. Hey, it's a few hours later. <laughs> I forgot to film me curling my hair. I curled my hair. This what she look like. It is very hard to curl. <laughs> short hair from like this point down but I tried my best I remember in high school when I would curl my hair I would just kind of do some strands I could manage to get in the iron and then the rest is just so short that you just can't really tell all the time so yeah this is what it looks like um again you know going through a change and honestly I did cry a little bit when I the first side it's so sped up that you, I don't know if you can tell but I did get kind of emotional but I did get my hair done in February so that's why it has like blonde in it because I got it balayage and then I got purple in it looks like my curls already yep they're already one thing because my hair just doesn't hold curl which is fine um so yeah now I'm I'm doing two courses online for school and I'm putting it back because uh I can't and it's nice because it goes into a little ponytail and it's really cute. So. Okay, that's kind of the video. I <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed. I cut about four inches off. If I feel great. Honestly, if you're thinking about cutting your hair, I would do it. Take your time. Be patient. If you're terrified, have someone help you that you trust. Get really good, sharp scissors. Again, mine are from Sally's Beauty Supply. You can type, literally go to Amazon.com, type in hair shears. If you pick the Amazon Choice hair shears, they'll be 
your best choice and yeah or if you have like hairstylists that you're really close with then talk to them um yeah so if you want to cut your hair i'd recommend doing it um you don't have to do it for any type of reason other than you want to um if you're going through a breakup like me you can do that too um i just opened youtube <laughs> And Joey Graceffa, YouTuber I've been watching since I was probably 11. Um, oh my God, for 10 years, holy crap. That's crazy to me. Um, he's going through a breakup as well. And it's like, I feel like we're doing the exact same thing because he just uploaded a video an hour ago of <laughs> that he shaved his head. <laughs> I love this. Okay, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content soon. And I will talk to you guys then.